So I'm Ruta Baker, Fairy Princess Sparkalumina, and I'm here to interview a future racer. Hi, future racer. What's your name? Amir Wanden. And Amir, how long have you been involved in kinetics? What have you done? I have participated in the Kinetic Classic. How many times? I was do I did the biking one. The Ruta Baker Rally. Ruta Baker Rally twice, and then I did the push cart four times. So six years you have been involved in the Kinetic Classic. Yes. <laughs> do you think that's a good way to get excited about racing for kids? Yeah. What have you built? Your, did you help build some of those push carts? Uh, yeah, that's <laughs> me and my partner Nairi. We did. We made a machine that we used for two years, and then we made a different machine, and then we made another machine. So, what was the hardest part about building your own machine? <laughs> the brake system. And I know, just actually building the machine. And I know you. The last time you did it, you actually had a spectacular moment where we almost had to invent a Golden Flipper Award for the Kinetic Classic with kids. What happened with your push cart? The back <laughs> wheels were on a single axle, and then there there was a handle that essentially went up, so it was very tippy. So when we were going up the hills, kind of hard, but then when we were going down it, it went like this, and my jacket got caught. On. <laughs> But you're also a different height and size than your partner. Yeah, so. yeah my partner is like a you, foot taller than me. You were more aerodynamic, I remember. So, yeah. <laughs> you almost flipped. It was exciting. <laughs> it was a great moment. Well, awesome. So what else have you done? Uh, have you, I know you were part of Spark Illumina's Entourage. Yes. At the Rutabaga Ball in 2016 and 18. Yes. And, and I was a peon for Trial of Bike. In 20, 2019? 2019. And then I was going to be in 2020 a peon for my dad's team, the Atomic Lasagna that didn't get to race. And then this next year I might be participating in the Swing Kids. Great, and you're going to learn a lot more about uh, bikes and yes. and how they work. And what did you do for your science project this well, year? Well, I was going to make a kinetic sculpture, but then I decided that was a little bit much. <laughs> and a little bit hard after I did some research. I mean, I already knew it was going to be hard. But... And then I ended up cutting a bike in half and fixing it. Not like putting it back together, but I fixed the brake system and gears and the derailleur. the derailleur and stuff. Cool. So, um, did you think you learned a lot with that? <laughs> yeah, I know how like the speeds of bikes and the gears, what they mean, stuff like that. Great. And so, uh, I know you've gotten some bribes for your bribe collection over the last yes. couple of years, and you, oh, yep, yeah, you've got I have a lot of pins. And then in here, I have my trial bike thing apron and a whole bunch of the gear uh bribes that are more necklaces and stuff that i usually wear during kinetics but this is where i put all my pins fantastic so would you think other people should get involved with kinetics yes it's and very fun and the art and it, even if you're not participating in the kinetics it's fun to watch great and so um so you'll be 14 this year right that starts yes. to be a more significant so, age <laughs> yeah because the older you get the more things you can do because you can't be a pilot until you have a driver's license so. but you're working on it you're, you're getting there yes <laughs> awesome or any final thoughts or messages to the world um kinetics is fun and okay. yeah for the glory thanks amira